Hey there, guys, gals, fans, and pals. Your buddy John Megacycle here. Another episode of Satisfactory coming at you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, let's see. Quick wire. Regular wire. Yeah. Um, yeah. That's how far I've gotten. The only other thing I need out of copper is cable. So cable's going to be its own thing. It's going to get its own ingots. And because that process is going to be a little weird, actually, I could take from wire, but I think I'd rather just have that zoop. I'd rather have that be its own, its own thing. I don't know if I'm explaining any of that right. Um, these things kind of butt up against each other. The cable's the last piece of the puzzle. Then the only thing I really need to do is saturate the market, so to speak, right? Um, that is Caterium. Oh, we're out of ingots? Oh my. Well, again, we're asking for some really big demand. So it makes perfectly sense we'd be out of that. Um, I do have that. That is full. I don't need Caterium wire on me ever again. So let's dump off some of this crap. Uh, scoot. Okay, looks good. Looks good. I think I'm going to trim out the ticket process over by iron. I know I've got that set up over there, that that way we just keep the stuff moving. Um, I don't really think there's too much of a point to it. Really? It's so weird that it just disappears. I think my graphic settings are fairly low or whatever. So it kind of makes sense that it does that. It's just weird that it does that. Okay, so let's go ahead and get started. Uh, do I have... Hold on. Hold on. I think I remember... I have a different process for this. Uh, insulated cable, which I need rubber. Maybe I produce cable on site then. It is very much more productive. So maybe cable gets done somewhere else. I was really thinking cable was like there's not there's not oil like around here, is there? That I could just tap for just this process. No. And considering I haven't heard a ding, I'm going to say, up. Oh. Yep, way, way, way south. If there was, like, I know there's one oil, yeah, way up there. I'm not going to tap that. Um, I kind of wanted cable to be its own, its own thing. But because of this much, much better recipe... I guess I'm going to do that at the manufactory. Uh, right, okay. So we've got ingot unload, copper sheet load, copper wire load. Nope, other side. This is... Quick wire load 01. Thank you. Um, I was gonna make this cable, like I said, but for now, I guess let's just leave it. It's not fast enough, that's not fast enough, that's not fast enough, that's not fast enough! Ugh! Ugh. My pride. <laughs> What's your best impression of Vegeta? Somebody randomly asked me that doesn't exist. Oh, my pride! <laughs> Oh, is this not even high enough for me to... Yes. Okay. I need way more boot scooties to get everything I need. Alright, so... God, this monstrosity, right? This absolute dumpster of a system. I shouldn't beat myself over it. I'm actually... Beat myself up over it. I'm actually pretty happy with how it panned out. Uh, I am. I really am. Um, 
But all this is going to go away. I don't really need to grind stuff. I, I don't think I... I never needed to grind stuff. Here's kind of my take on things. I'm not, like, a collection person. I'm not really a guy to be like, Oh, man, I gotta get 100% on this thing. I gotta really collect all the things. Nah. 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 I like cosmetics, but they're not the driving force for me to do a thing ever. Um, I played Apex Legends poorly. <laughs> Brag, right? Uh, this is four and then five? Interesting. And that game is mostly gotcha unlocks and what have you. These are all four? No, I didn't want... Damn it. Oh, I didn't even plug this in? Oh, I didn't plug any of this stuff in. Interesting. Okay, anyway. Um, that was the main thing I wanted to get rid of. Well, I should plug this stuff in now. I don't know why I'm not going to plug stuff in. Um, five. I could have sworn I plugged this crap in, but, I mean, clearly I did not. Uh, which is fine. I'm not going to beat myself up over it. Somebody else will, I'm sure. But I'm not going to do it. Okay. Steel piping? Steel piping. Cool. So I named the stations. I didn't load any of it. Okay. Fine. Fine and fair. That has... What the heck? I need an adult. How was this supposed to ever work? And That's at least my problem when playing too many of these games in too much of a quick succession is what generally happens is I get a little tunnel vision. Let me back that up. I get a lot of tunnel vision. And so what ultimately occurs... These are all... Well, these are all fours. Um, what ultimately occurs is I get tunnel vision and then I lose track of exactly what the crap I'm doing. And then when I do that, similar tasks start to blend together. What do I mean by that? I don't want extra storage... First, I don't. I decided I don't want that. I think the storage we already have in the train is fine. Uh, what was I talking about? Is this four or five? Damn it! I don't want to pick stuff up. This is already five. Okay. Well, I'm already mixing the lines and whatever. Uh, I get bad tunnel vision. Which really means exactly as it sounds, is after doing repeated tasks over and over and over again, if I don't see them to completion, I forget what the crap I was doing. So, same thing with this. Like, we've been working on... We've been working on this train stuff for, like, the last... I don't know. Twelve episodes? Like, talking about trains, and then doing the trains, and then getting frustrated about trains. Like, I mean, we've been we've been doing trains for a long time. Whenever I've had our expedition episodes, where I'm like, you know, I'm just going to explore the Great Blue Yonder, or whatever. Those are really critical breaks for me to just unwind a little bit and just be like, okay. Um, yes. Um, getting like a continuity break, right? Because what happens is if I just stay hyper fixated on one thing, it's either going to get done weirdly or it might not even get done at all. So this is kind of the weirdness of it is I've, I'm admitting like I'm, I'm hyper fixated on a thing and then I'm like, oh man, now we got to do Caterium. Oh man, now we got to go do Steel. Oh man, and then we just keep spinning into oblivion and then nothing gets done. I don't know what gave us a, a little bit of a boost there, but something did. See, sometimes you glide down. I'm gliding down right now. Other times, I just slap. And it's like, well, that was fun and enlightening. Cool. All right. So there's that handled there. This is all still quietly humming away. 
Um, I'm going to do cable somewhere else because we have a better recipe that also requires rubber. Uh, so there's that. So we have iron all plugged in. We have copper and all of its products all plugged in. Yeah. I think we're good. Uh, what comes next now? Uh, rubber's plugged in. Bauxite's plugged in. That's green for some reason. Is Why are these green? Oh, okay. Uh, whatever. <laughs> why is this green? I can't even interact with it, so I don't know what the heck. Uh, that's also green. Hmm. Something weird's afoot. So what is next? Uh, it's time to build, like, the mega manufactory, right? Oh, man. I don't know. I don't know if I even want to. <laughs> this is the nerve-wracking part. Let's head over to the hub. Which is... Uh, more over here-ish. Power slug. How are you sitting here? I bet you, you these guys have to respawn, right? There's just so many. I can't imagine I, I would miss that one willingly, but apparently I missed that one willingly. Is cool. Is cool. Free cake. Free cake. Uh, where'd it go? There you are, you sneaky kid. Okay. Uh, if not hazmat suit, control system development, which I can buy. I can buy the aluminum casing, I can buy the alclad aluminum. This doesn't actually give me anything super great, though. Aeronautical engineering. I can buy all these things except radio control unit. Okay, how do I even unlock that? Radio control unit. Okay. Uh, gas filter requires... Oh! It's not super expensive. Uh, aluminum casing, right, quick wire, right. I mean, those are all fairly simple for me to hear. Uh, just to prove a point. Uh, quick wire is in the system. Yeah, there it is. I just blasted right past it. There's that. Do I have enough of that casing on hand? Oh, it might be in the system, actually. I know I picked up some of it along the way, but probably not 200 or 100 worth. Oh, 146. Look at that crap. Hey, friend. Boop. Uh, I'll be able to get this done a lot faster than I thought. Okay, what do I need for... It's probably equipment, now that I think about it. I don't need the gas mask. I need gas filters. To which case, I should probably just make a crap ton of fabric anyway. Polyester fabric. Man, that's expensive. Um, you don't need 50 gas masks. Gas filter. Made in equipment workshop. I must be just daft. There it is. It is two fabric. And some coal. I don't think I have a lot of coal on me. I do have some coal. I should probably put coal in the system with how many one-offs I've needed for it. Uh, we have mycelium. We have some bug guts, which I'm not going to use anything else for. I don't have any other biomass on me. Any biomass I would have had is already a part of the system. The bio power plant system. So I need... Buy fabric. I need 250 fabric. How much of that crap can I make? Oh yeah, I forgot. keep forgetting about that. I want to make sure. 250 fabric? No, 100 fabric. 
to make 50 gas filters. Okay. 100 fabric. I carried the three too far. Uh, this won't take super long. It's a one-off. If I needed fabric for some other long-term industrial process, I'd automate it. Guess what? I'm not going to automate it. <laughs> it seems silly to automate something I need a one-off for. I, I'm i sure I'll need it. I'm sure I'll need it. I guess my, my real intention is what I'm going to do is I'm going to build out our nuclear system and then pipe the material into it and then never go back. <laughs> that's the plan. That's the whole that's the whole plan. It's the entirety of everything. Just build up the system and that's it. You're done. There is some screaming outside. It's either a sporting event or someone's being murdered. I can't tell the difference. Oh, right. Because it's in here. Cool. 50 on the, on the nose. Now, this is probably assuming we already have aluminum research and automated because it's asking for it as a component. Uh, I don't. I don't have that. I can buy that, though. Which is equally good. Not not really, but we're going to call it that. Whoa. I was going to take a sip of water, but I guess we're done with that. Um, hello, friend. Guess what? Chicken butt. Milestone reached. The hazmat suit protects the wearer from radiation by consuming iodine-infused filters. You may find this protection essential if you are going to finally get around to saving humanity. I previously gave you compliments in an attempt to inspire you, but it might have given you the wrong idea. I will definitely be totally honest with you from this moment on. Here is a demonstration of a truthful compliment. That suit looks like it was made for you. Because it was. Ah. Uh. Oh my god. All oh, right, wrong suit. Insufferable in every way possible. I can hear it. I can hear it in the back. Hey, Jeff, why don't you just get over it? It's not that big of a deal. She's actually a really nice lady. No. I won't get over it. <laughs> how about that? How about how about that? Uh, what are these? Chips. Circuit boards. Let's just get let's just get a bunch of this in our system. I might need it later. Uh, what I need though, straight up our computers and crap, which I think are in the other direction. These are the frames. We have a bunch of frames. Oop. Okay, thanks. Once I build the ultimate factory, then I'll give two shoots about shoots, but we're not quite there yet. One of you is computers. AI connectors. One of you is computers question mark. Uh, yeah, I'm just probably going to cannibalize everything that's here. I don't care about that. I'll take this. I'll take this. I'm sure I'm missing heavy frames for something. Uh, motors could be put in the system. Heavy. I do have heavy modular frames already. Okay. Go on. Okay. Computer. Nope. Uh, computer. 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 That is the 200 I need to complete the thing. However, I would like a little sugar stash for myself. A little sugar stash for myself. Sugar stash is like... I, have I ever talked about a sugar stash? I think I have in Factorio when we've done Factorio things. 
A sugar stash is just a rainy day cache of materials. I saw you wave at it as if you grabbed it, and then you didn't grab it. It's a rainy day cache of materials is what it is. To ensure that I have the stuff I need in case I need it. A really good example is when we played games like, oh, let's say Warptorio is a really good example. There have been times where I've been a little greedy on raw materials, water, coal, because that assumes we, or that, you know, better ensures we have power to do the stuff we need. I call that our sugar stash. It's just a little bit of extra to get us by, you know? Just a little bit to just get us through the day. So I can buy L-clad aluminum. Oh, I can even buy the casing. 200? Buy this tech level for four tickets? You're darn right I will. Man, as much crap as I can get research beforehand before I make large logistical decisions, the better. Let's go ahead and knock this guy out into a power shard. Snap into a power shard. Because I can't say the other thing you would snap into. If you know what John Megacycle would willingly snap into, put it in the comments below. It's appropriate. It's not It's not, not safe for work. It's very appropriate. Should I just say it? Because now it sounds incriminating. <laughs> you snap into a Slim Jim. There's a wrestler of quite high repute. Mo most, of, most of my uh, martial arts knowledge comes from wrestlers. Of way back when. Of olden days. What am I missing? Oh, right. Lestique. Lestock. Lestook. Uh, boom. We're already halfway there. Uh, what else can I chuck into this system that'd be nice to have? Oh, the motors. Yeah, let's get some motors in there. I have versatile framework on me for reasons. Uh, oh, I still have 19 other coupons in the thing. Awesome. Awesome to the max. That can just get in there as well. Do I have 100 more plastic? Eh, this takes a while. Boo. Uh, I have nine spheres. What do I need for the next faster thing? Thirteen spheres. Tempting. It's tempting to go out and find four more spheres. Legitimately. Well, we're just going to wait here. So, uh, copper, iron, ste steel's not in the system yet. Uh, steel's in the system, and then we build the Mega Manufactory. Oh! Uh, bauxite. Aluminum. I want to do that first. I want to super duper do that first. We might have a process for that. We might have a process for that. Where's plastic? I keep forgetting what the crap I'm supposed to be doing. Man, I do appreciate how quick this is, though. Like, this is still much faster than me running all the way to whatever. Which makes me think I should have done this at the beginning part of the game if I could have. Hey, guess what? Chicken butt. Milestone reached. Several parts more efficient and powerful than the human brain can now be made to compensate for many deficiencies otherwise encountered in future development efforts. The blender enables you to mix and or combine parts and fluids for more complex recipes. Most importantly, project part number six, the assembly director system, should be produced and delivered to the space elevator as soon as possible. Eh. Eh. <laughs> as soon as possible is fairly a non sequitur at this point at best, I think. Okay, there's 150 motors in the system to be. I have one, two, and a half. One, two, three. That's more than a rotors. Now I need to figure out how to make the other thing. 
Um, I'm also gonna, yep, you guessed it, buy this upgrade. There's quite literally no reason not to. I feel. Uh, yoink, yoink, yoink. No, wait. Unyoink one of those. Thank you. Okay, alclad aluminum, motors... Okay, I'm just missing the radar? What is that? Uh, cable, concrete, quartz, rotor, motor, radio control unit. Um, oof, that needs a lot of this casing crap. Oh, and it needs oscillators too? Ugh. They're adorable, they're functional, they're weird, and oh my god, they take so long to make it, I hate them. I'm just kidding, I love them. The pot will return in 13 minutes? What? Where's that one pod going? Where, where, where is that one pod going? One pod? There's the one punch man, there's one piece in this one pod that just scrimble scrambled its way somewhere else. Yeah, whatever, I don't like you either. Whatever. <laughs> whatever we're talking about now. Alright. This require yeah, all this key I'm gonna need a lot of casing. Wow, I'm gonna have to buy some casing. Alright, well that's gonna punch a hole in our ticket budget, which is pretty fine. If I gotta spend another 10 tickets to get this thing done, I will. I already slapped up the shop. You just hang tight there, Slappy. Okay, how many more of these can I make? 34. Oh, this isn't too bad at all. Okay. We're gonna run out of casing again. This at least gives me a second to clean my glasses. There's been a smudge on it this whole time and I wasn't sure if it was a figment of my imagination or it was squigglies that I got from staring at the sun when I was a kid or if it was actually factually grease. Hold on. The jury's in. It was just dirt and grease. Ooh. Ooh. -wee. Mess around with my glasses and everything like I'm professional style. Professional. E E F professional. Professional. That's something that's really weird now that I've noticed when as I've gotten older is I keep making funny words and names for things, which is starting to really damage the way I spell. <laughs> like, if somebody said, oh, it's a very professional suit you've got there, and I'm like, yes, I'm gonna write that down. It's a good word. I like that word. Professional. P O F F E S S I O N A L professional. And then if somebody like is on the same humor level as me, I'm hoping they'd say, "Oh, you forgot the, you forgot there's three L's at the end." And be like, "Yes, I did. Thank you, sir." And that's it. I'm just on my merry jolly doing merry jolly things. This is actually going to hemorrhage some of the stuff out of, out of the system, which is fine. So I still need to buy 200 more. Uh, I probably need to buy three more units of it. Where are we at? Yep, plenty. I left. Plenty left. I still like how the Mercer Sphere just wigs out a little bit. You can, you can still see it in the inventory. It's all twitchy. Okay, there's our fitty. Um, I should have all the stuff. 50, 100, 200, 300. Yeah, we done with that. Nice. That moves up. Uh, tickets go away. Uh, these go away. Uh, 
Essek is regaining. Quartz, Quartz, Quartz Crystal. Quartz Crystal is regaining. Oh, we can chuck some of that in there. Solid biofuel. Motor I just topped off. Wood. Meh. Uh, circuit boards. Staters I wouldn't mind to fill up a bit. I have turbo motors. I got a bunch of wacky crap. Oh, uh, right. Copper sheets, polymer resin. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with all this. You could do that. So we could speed this up a little bit. That'd be delightful. I don't think I'll need casing for anything. Aside for crafting other crap. We need the L-clad aluminum. Or... Uh, my brain just broke. We need the all-clad aluminum for type 5 belts. I'd really love to build my factory out of T5. So what we're going to do is we're going to work on... There we go. Cool, thank you. We're going to work on uh, bauxite. So, let's talk about that again. B-A-U-X spells bauxite. We need to start with bauxite and water, which we could do that at the thing. Bauxite is not used for anything else this time. That produces an alumina solution and silica. The alumina solution... Oh, I need this crap for batteries and stuff. Oh, uh, huh. I need a coal train. Where can I get a coal train? All that's already used for power. This is used for steel. There's a lot of coal here. We could... We could make one of these a coal train. I don't honestly see any other part of the infrastructure that that makes any sense. Uh, so that's what we'll probably do. Uh, what else do I need? Let's go. I mean, I'm, I'm going to just kill time for six minutes, I guess. Okay, opening codex. So assuming I have the alumina solution and coal, we have the scrap. And I thought we had a better scrap recipe. Aluminum ingot. We use that same silica that we made before to make four, or it's a two-to-one. The benefit of it being a two-to-one, it's slightly more expensive, but it's a lot faster because it's made in a smelter. That's dope. I like that very much. So that makes an aluminum ingot. Aluminum ingots are then going to be pushed into... Oh, this is where any copper ingots. Crap. I don't have... Oh, I do have copper ingots. Um... Shoot, how do we do that? I guess I add another stop. We go copper ingots. Bauxite plant. And then the copper yard. Okay. Okay. Dang it. I was really hoping we could get a different recipe for the sheets. Yep, that is the only that's the only recipe in the game. Apparently. That is the only recipe in the game. Alright. Not the end of the world. Um just a bit of a thing. Okay, drum port. Ooh, deep breaths. Uh, can you scroll back to the top, please? Functions as home port to a single drone, with transports available input back and forth between its home port and its destination ports. Drone ports only have one other port assigned as their destination. Drone port interface provides delivery details and... Man. All right. <laughs> transports available input back and forth, blah, 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 blah. How many... 
How many? How much? Did it say how much uh, stuff it had? It has nine inventory slots. Use any fuel type. Refuels at any of the connected ports. Now, any fuel type could mean one of two things. It could mean coal, biofuel, fuel. It could mean a bunch of crap. Um, so I'm kind of glad we didn't get into trucks, I guess. I don't know. Coffee me? Coffee? That's all I do. I put my head backwards and just... Rah, coffee. Coffee! Security camera. Ah. Hold on. I have a present for you. Oh. Uh, I have a present for you. <laughs> I got him, Pa. I got him. Nope, I didn't get nothing. Well, that was fun. Man, this clickety clacker is still going. No, I don't want to play Productive Packer Deluxe. Thank you. Uh, two minutes. I guess we're going to do a round of Picker Packer... Picker... Picker Packer Deluxe. Productive Packer. I think this is like a Tetris thing, isn't it? Uh... Sure. Oh, I don't remember how to play... Okay, uh... Okay, I do remember how to play this. I lied. Why is this so loud? So loud! Uh... Well, that sucks. Uh, this sucks. <laughs> I don't have any compatible parts. Send that shiz. Uh, nope. This music is spastic. Oh, I didn't see that thing fast enough. Oh. Hardly any of these are going to work. Dude, these pieces are just too awkward. They're like me at a party. They're just too, too awkward. Oh. Alright, not too bad. Hey, two stars. I'm pretty happy with that. Uh, no. I'm good, thank you. Yeah, we have 45 seconds for the thing to come back. What I bet you any money that's going to happen is this is going to require a bunch of stuff that I don't have. Ideally, the easy way to handle this is going to be automating fuel. Go to oil, completely automate fuel, put it in buckets, right? And then have a drone transport the fuel buckets to all the places that need stuff. And that's it. And then we drone whatever we want, right? So we have one, one initial drone to get all the stuff all over the place, and then we do whatever with everything else. That's my plan with it. I don't know if any of that's going to work, but we'll see. So that was a fun 16 minutes or whatever. Kind of flew by a little faster than I thought. Yeah, so down here. Oil. Fuel. All that. And then I'll just pipe it everywhere we gotta go. Oh, whoops. Hold on. Um... Right, I know you just put that away, and I'm sorry. <laughs> hey, guess what? Chicken butt. Milestone reached. Drones provide automated low-capacity aerial transport between drone stations. Stations need to be supplied with any kind of fuel for the drones to function. Fixit had several restrictions in place prohibiting creative use of drones. I have since removed those because I think no pioneer would ever misuse Fixit property right under their noses. Especially since everything is recorded. Uh-huh. 
Okay, I need more radio parts. Oh, which means I probably need more oscillators. Ah, dang it. Here's why I don't like this recipe. Here, here's, here's the skinny. All right, here's the scoop. It costs so much numbers to make it. It doesn't matter what. This eats up a stupid amount of cable and an even stupider amount of everything else. That's what that's what bugs my butts about it. Um, like there's also recipes that require. Uh, what is it? They require. Like, 52 wire, or whatever, and it's like, dude, come on. You could have made this more difficult in a different way. Like, make the recipe a little slower or something. 52 items, come on. Or whatever, yeah, 32 casings. 32 whatever's whatever's. Okay, what did I need again for this? I keep hitting the wrong button. I need 10 for that. I need one for that. I need a miner. That's interesting. Um, can I have one more bump? I'm probably going to need to buy more parts. Thank you. Okay. A drone port. This thing is gigantic. Are you kidding me? Holy crap. Outgoing, incoming, no power, last fuel type. <coughs> this is... This is gigantic. Holy crap! I thought this was going to be like a little hobbyist thing. Nope. Yeah, I don't care about the blender. Hey, buddy. Okay, you have no fuel. You require 100 megawatts. Drone status loading. Maximum transfer rate. Outgoing transfer rate. Incoming transfer rate. This port. Our landa. All ports. Okay, so... Nope. Uh, okay. Home port says... The views of port. Must be built on a drone port. Can use any fuel type. Refuel. Okay, how many drones can I have? It's just the one drone? Which is the home port for a single drone. Transports input back and forth between home port and destination ports. Drone ports can have other ports assigned as they're just... Da, 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 da. Okay. Got it. So if I wanted to do what I said I was going to do, I would do one, one depot at fuel, right? And then I would have all these other ones set up to receive the fuel. Okay, so that's that's cool. Um Okay. Um I don't want to push any more technology. Actually, what does this one do? Resource well pressurizer, resource well extractor, empty fuel tank, nitrogen gas heat sink, coolant system, fuse mod. Okay. This doesn't make this doesn't make better aluminum. This uses aluminum differently. Leading edge production. Minor mark three. Yeah, I can't. I can't touch any of that, and that's fine. Um, what I was hoping is we could push a little bit farther, maybe unlock some more cool crap, but that's not going to happen. Okay. Next on our plate, bauxite. I need coal. Hold on. I need coal and copper, correct? Coal. Oh, I also need water. Uh, coal and copper. Coal is there. Man, I wish there was some copper. There is some copper nearby. <clears throat> we could do this whole thing here. So how far would I take it? If I could take it all the way, how far would we take it? Illumina solution. To get the scrap. I also need the batteries, right? I really use this fuel for drones and view. Oh, hold on. Before I get too far down the rabbit hole, so to speak, 
I want to see if the drone can use regular fuel. If it can't, this is going to be very interesting. Smen smackin' backin'. All right, that's what we called it before, smackin' backin'. When you slap somebody in the back of the head, oh, you're an idiot, slap. Slappin' backin'. Hip and happen, slappin' backin'. Hip and happen, and a little slippin' backin', slappin', slappin' backin'. We oh, forgot that's our other thing. Zoom. And bump. So. Oh, I think I have fuel in the thing, don't I? Ah, this was a waste. Oh well. Uh, actually, it won't be a waste because I will need the drone to do tra uh, destination transportation and stuff. Oh, this might fit perfectly. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Uh, I have fuel on my person. Trip cost zero. Per oh, I see. Okay. Um, so the idea is, um, I don't know if I need this storage container. I don't know if I need that much, but it might not be a bad idea to have that much. Okay. So get rid of this. Thank you. It's cute that it needs a little mining drone to do the thing. So we have to come all the way over here to plastic. This is going to come up and get shimmied all the way down there so we can automate fuel. Let's thread the needle. The needle's going to be a little dodgy, but that's okay. Can I get... Nope, sure can't. Not even close. Okay. Um. Okay. I have a stupid way to do this. And I say stupid because I'm the one doing it. Uh, one more? This at least looks reasonable, right? Like, it doesn't look like it's magically floating in space. I think I'm respecting the rule of the game, I guess is what I'm really getting at here. Uh, yeah, one more. I think I actually did a very, vi hello, ah. Uh, anyway, I think it did a really very good job with oil. Petrochem stuff can be incredibly intimidating, but I think, I think it looks good. Um, if I need to expand any more anywhere, we can. We actually do have. Now that I think about it, we do have another oil thing I have not tapped yet. Oh, we're gonna do this one more time. No. Thank you. Is there a zoop? Oh my god, there is. Ah, uh, I was just thinking, you know, be really dope is if this had a zoop build mode. Guess what, dummy? It do. Oh, hey, the freighter came back. Can't wait to see what other really expensive crap I can't afford. Okay. So I kind of stand by what I said. This process actually cooks pretty fast, I think. And I have two of them. 
Did I not... Okay, I screwed something up. Oh! It's a smart splitter. It's a smart splitter. It's not going to feed this way ever. Right? Um... Overflow? What's the right overflow? It should kind of be any any. Oh, right overflow is going to... No, straight is overflow. Oh, I see. Yeah, we're not we're not purging items. Oh, we're pre-purging them. Okay, yep, cool. So, plastic gets hucked over here. It gets turned into jugs. I think this conversion is a 1 to 2. Uh, 60 jugs a minute. Uh, 40 jugs a minute. Okay, so it's a little less than that. Or a little more than that, maybe. Uh, anyway, this is fine by me. Wow, is that how this works? You already have the container, so it just blasts the crap inside of it. Dude, weird stuff. Weird stuff. Uh, three is fine. Interesting. No, no, I mean, keep at it. Don't get a bunch of fuel everywhere. That doesn't sound hazardous beyond all reproach. Okay, now it's automatable. Now it'll go right there. Uh, what I am going to do, though, is I'm going to put up a splitter here. So I could do something with it later. If we want to do the drone thing, we could do the drone thing. But there we go. That's Now that's what I call fuel. We have a lot of fuel. Holy crap. We have a lot of power as well. Ugh. I feel like we got a lot done. <laughs> I really do. I'll take my coupons. Thank you. That bought a good chunk of our uh, upgrade stream. All right, now um, I think I want to go. Oop, boink. Do I have a? No, I don't have a propulsion majig, madu, ma thing, ma have. Um, that's fine. So, uh, I keep hitting B for build, but it's B for bright. Everyone knows that. So, we have the bauxite with the water. We can make the alumina solution. The alumina solution is really probably what has to get carted around. We also have the coal. Uh, oh, right, batteries. Is this sulfuric acid, maybe? Yeah, okay. Which is going to be its own kettle of fish. So what I think should go up there by bauxite should be alumina solution, aluminum, nope, I don't think aluminum scrap, nope, uh, aluminum ingots. The aluminum ingots are going to be turned into a bunch of stuff. Okay, so the alumina solution and aluminum ingots. I think that's our thing. The coal is there. The copper is there. I don't want to have to create a brand new mega station just for aluminum. I'm probably going to have to. Um, but I think I can get a lot of that done here. There's already plenty of water, I think. Come on, take me up. Thank you. Over here is also our geysers. Hey, Nico. Okay, come on up. You're gonna, you're gonna want up here anyway. I'll just elbow my stomach. It's fine. It's fine. See a sluggo. Yeah, water down there is gonna do me zero favors. Come on, get me. Get to me! Thank you. That crap was close. Do you see that? See that kitty? Crap was close. That stuff was Glenn, right? Why am I calling it Glenn? Glenn Close? 
I had a friend who was like really into it's concerning that that's not full. What? What the heck? Interesting. Um, I had a friend that was really into celebrities a long time ago. I, I, I should reach out to him. I wonder how they're doing. Uh, really, really into celebrities. So what we would do is, like, I don't do celebrities. I don't I don't follow an actor or an actress except Tim Curry. They're a god. Can we just admit that? Um, but, like, I don't, I don't keep track of, like, uh, historical reference. Oh, yeah, I remember them and... Uh, Butt Punchers 3, The Reckoning, or whatever. It's like, I blah, 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 blah. <laughs> no idea who this is or what we're talking about. And it's fine. Um, but what we do is we would come up with little... Nah, comments probably aren't the right word. But, like, we come with little sayings and be like, Oh, man, that was totally Glenn. And no one would know what we were talking about. It's like our own little language. It's like, Glenn Close is the name of an actor. I think. There's only, like, two or three that I knew... Just that one by name. Uh, one of my favorites is Cherie's Throne. And I'm probably mispronounced that. I do apologize. So instead of to each their own, instead of to each their own, I say Cherie's Throne. I'm very funny. I'm very funny. And that's all we're going to say about that. Okay, so these pump how much again? 120, I think. 120. And we have... Oh, yeah, we got the good shit. We got that good shit. I probably don't even need the good the good stuff, right? I probably don't even, but we're going to do it. Can I borrow you? I mean, I'm not going to be particular. The game's not going to be particular. Uh, this has been bugging me this whole time. It bugged me when we were here three times ago, and it's bugging me now. What the heck? Yeah, that's what I thought. Give me that back lip by not exploding. Ah, oh, reloading interrupts it? Come on. Thank you. Okay, we got some real water now. now. That's what I call real water. Okay, we are going up and over. Smack and back in. Yep, over there. Okay. Smack him in the back in. Smack and back him. We want a pipeline pump to 50 meters upwards. Oh, uh, okay. I don't think I'm doing this right. Oh, pipe is too long. Oh, okay. Um... All right, uh... Must snap the foundation. Okay, you win. Okay. So the pipe should really be connected to where this actually gets like this, right? I think. I think that makes sense. Uh, is that less than 50? Hold on. Uh, 4, 8, 12, 24, 36. 
Mm, I'd say that's dangerously close to 50, but not above it. Um, I got water kind of up here. Yeah, we're just gonna we're just gonna double it up. The fluid dynamics of this game are probably my least favorite part of it, but whatever. Now that should give us some real nope. Okay. Now that should give us some real pepper. Yes, it does. Ooh, all the pepper. Ooh, cayenne, black, all the kinds of pepper. I don't know any other kinds of pepper. Let's do red, red pepper, red pepper. No, that's that's the three. There's only three kinds of pepper I know. <laughs> I'm so boring. Oh, uh, no, 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 not not horizontal to vertical. Thank you. Actually, now that I put that pipe there, that pump. Uh, just auto? Yeah. Automoto. Something like that? Okay. So we're gonna have a boatload of water. <laughs> That's funny, because you don't want your boats to have water. You want them to be in water, ideally, but not... Whatever. So here's our water. I also need coal. Which I'm gonna go grab in a hot, a hot second here. It looks like Caterium to me. Looks like I don't want none because I've already got it all. Terium. Cook, cook, Caterium. Ah, yes, just leave me to die on the side of the road. Thanks. I wonder if the I wonder if the power network is like I'm done carrying him. Forget this. He could build his own, like, re responsible character. We're not... We're done with this. Which is usually how, whenever I play Risk of Rain with somebody, that's usually how that goes. Like, whatever the first item or second item I get, I'm like, oh man, I can't wait to make an entirely terrible decision for the next two hours based on this one item. And then my friends look at me and like, oh boy, we can't wait for you to make entirely terrible decisions over the next two items or this... or next two hours over this one item. And I'm like, I know, right? <laughs> We're going to have fun. Ah, uh, okay. Um, I think that's good enough for this episode. Blanc. Oh, oh, okay, 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 okay. Up, uppies. Up. Okay. This is not a power tower. This is a radar tower. Okay, that's why we're losing it. Okay. That was scary. That was scary. All right, there is our picture for the thing. Um, yeah, good progress, I think. We unlocked a bunch of technology... And we're going to finally sit down and do Bauxite, finally. So, thank you all for joining me. My name's John Megacycle, and I hope to catch you next time. Hey there, guys, gals, fans, and pals. Thanks for checking out my video. I also want to take a moment to thank all my supporters and donators, and if you'd like to join up with me and game with my crew, all the information to get connected is in the description below. Thanks again, and I hope to catch you next time.